Alright guys, we are back here with another Dokkan Battle video and for today's video, I'm gonna go ahead and take down the um, current new battlefield here that we have. Uh, I believe this is, yeah, back to normal um, since we had just finished the, whatchamacallit, we just finished the Namek one for the new celebration, right? Um, let's see, what are some new units that I could probably bring? Probably, yeah, probably, or maybe them. Let's see. I don't know. I feel like they don't fit on the current team that I have. Um. Yeah, we'll we'll, we'll bring you instead. Yeah, instead of uh, Buhan there. And then as far as the other ones, maybe that Trunks I could bring for SDR. Um. Yeah, I'll bring I'll bring him instead of you. Um, wait, where did where did he go? Oh, there, there it is. Mine's at sixty nine, right? Yeah. Um, and then Piccolo, he's kind of he kind of sucks. You, maybe this Go Tanks. Uh, for Super Int, I could probably bring him over. Yeah, we'll bring we'll bring him over. GT trio there, and then yeah, we'll we'll go with that. All right. So we'll do extreme tech here. We'll do yeah, we'll do you and you. We'll do boo, you, seventeen, full of visa, and then we'll do massive. Sure. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, uh, um, I feel like there's there's just not much uh, in our current celebration, right? So right now we have the um, the AGL Kid Gohan celebration here on Global, and like yeah, like I said, I feel like there's just not much going on. Like uh, we have the Easy A for the Great Apes, which I already finished, and I'm, I'll be doing some showcase on all of them later today. Um, but then apart from that, like, there's really not much else going on. We have the new story event for Piccolo, uh, the one that will awaken into, uh, it's like, uh, Piccolo and Krillin, I think, their support for Heavenly events. But then, yeah, like, apart from that, what, what else is there? The new Gohan and, um, Garlic Jr., and then their new events. Which I don't know if you really can consider that content. Uh, I'm sure you can, but I don't know. Uh, I mean, for someone like me, for example, who like didn't summon on those banners, it's not really content, you know what I mean? Because I'm not getting anything out of it. Uh, but then apart from that, yeah, apart from that, there's really no nothing else going on. Mm. So, um, it is what it is, I guess. Uh, I wonder what is probably next. Next is probably, hmm, so I feel like the Gohan, uh, banner will probably go until about, like, the, the, somewhere between the 15, no, no, because he hasn't been up for that long. I feel like he could probably be living around the 20th or so, or, I don't know, but I feel like we're probably gonna get heroes, um, late October. And then, hmm. I'm trying to think, because I remember last year we got the, what you call it, that um, we got that one banner right for that was I believe it was only on global where we did we actually didn't get anything new on October and then instead we got that banner that was like. The Halloween banner, I think it, 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 it's what it was, and it was like it had like AGL thirteen, STR cooler, Ultimate Gohan, Namek Goku. It had just like those like they're they're pretty good though. Confess at the time, I mean some of them are still pretty good, but like back then they were actually pretty recent. Um, but yeah, I mean apart from that, I I, I don't know what else would come out. Um. 
another thing is I I wonder what's coming out for um here hold on let's do you we'll do you 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 sure we'll bring them and then support yeah that's good um but the other thing that I was wondering is so Oh, sorry, I'm all over the place today. Um, so, usually for Global, on November, like towards the end of, the, of November is when we get the Thank You Celebration, who is usually the dual Dokkan Fest that comes out in during Golden Week for, for JP, right? Which is in March or April, something like that. Um, now, the thing is, this year we actually, like as you guys probably are already aware, we got those units on, like, on Global at the same time as JP did, who were the um, GT Super Saiyan Goku and GT Super Saiyan Vegeta. So now that has me thinking, like, what are we going to get for the Global version, right? Like, is it, are we still going to celebrate a, a thank you celebration? Or is it, is it going to be something different? You know what I mean? Hey, what did I share? Little Beatdown Park is pretty fun. That's cool. Um... So yeah, that actually I I hadn't thought about that just yet. Like, what is gonna happen with that? Oh come on, don't lower his attack. Oh. Wait, what was that? I I missed it. Did that say three or four million? Oh my god. Or hmm, I'll have to double check that. Um, once I finish recording. Okay. But yeah, um, as far as October, so as, as far as October goes, we probably will be getting. Oh wait, but also we have the part two LR right for, for this event, like for this current celebration, we have part two LR. Hmm. Dang man, I I really don't know what's coming then, like, because we'll we'll get the LR Goku and Piccolo for part two, uh, presumably, right? So part two, uh, well, I'll have to see. Uh, I'll have to see like when exactly is it that we're getting. Um, that we'll be getting the, like, new banner. Um, I, again, I assume probably towards late October, but then heroes, like, what will happen then? Or will maybe the LR Goku and Piccolo get delayed and then Heroes comes out? Or, or maybe both come out at the same time. I don't know. But I feel like that's not a very, a very wise decision. Or maybe Heroes in November? Or Wait, is Heroes actually in November? And I'm just... I feel like Heroes in November sounds about right. Um, I know we're getting the... Uh, 11 year anniversary stream for Heroes. I'll probably be watching that if I can. Um, like if I don't have any like school stuff to do or something, because I know that's usually super late. Like, it's like since it's Japanese time, it's usually at like in the AM for us, like two or three in the morning or something. I remember watching it last year though for the ten year anniversary. It was so much fun. And that actually isn't that when we got the version C um, announcement. No way. No, there's no way that was that was it. So if it was, then like it's already been a full year. No, I I really don't think that's when it was. I, no, no, it definitely wasn't because that was for the Dragon Ball. Um, there was a that Dragon Ball like convention, wasn't it? Wasn't it for that? I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah, what do they say? Yeah, we'll do this. Um, yeah, so for Heroes, I mean, I, I assume we're probably just going to be getting, like, the new units revealed. Hmm. I, I really do wonder what we'll be getting this year. I mean, it's kind of like a, what, how do you say, like, it's like a either or, right? Like, it's so random that, like, you could genuinely be, be getting anything, right? Like, you could be getting, like... Limited or Super Saiyan 4 uh, Limits Broken Vegeta and Goku or you could be getting like Super Saiyan I don't know like Super Saiyan Raditz or something like 
You know what I mean? Like, it could be anything, honestly. But, yeah, with that said, I, I'm really excited for Heroes. Um, that's what I'm currently saving all my stones for. Um, because it's just so... They're all so cool units. And, like, I mean, the units from last year are still pretty decent. Like, they're not, like, the craziest. And, and they don't, like... Power creep has just been so high that they don't really... Um... What's the word? Like, they're not really equal to any do of the current Doka class. I mean, like, for example, compare, like, STR Super Vegeta to the physical Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. Like, he's, like, a thousand times better, right? But again, like, you can't really fully compare them together, you know? Um, who should I run as a second? Yeah, we'll do you. Yeah, I think that's good. Uh, you for the rainbows, you, you, we'll do you for the support, no, we'll do you for the support, because you appear Saiyan, and then, we'll do you as well, sure, for the double support there, um, but yeah, as far as the heroes units go, I, I really do like summoning for them because of how limited they are, and like, their banner is truly only there once a year, right? So, um, I should have probably brought a sealer unit. But also, this Goku is not really that big of a deal anymore. Like, again, with the current power creep, he we usually can tank his super attack like it's nothing. Like, he, he, he does do a good amount of damage, but it's nothing like... Like, SBR probably hits different than... Or probably hits harder, I mean than what this Goku can hit sometimes. But yeah, for heroes, since they're only here once a year, um, I do like summoning for them. And like I said, the the ones from last year are pretty decent. Like, Super Saiyan 4 Vegito has his counter, and like, he has the support, and he's he has the cool leader skill. Uh, Tech Broly's decent as well. I only have him 55, but he, I mean, he's still pretty good. Um... The Dabora and the other demon guy, I can't remember his name right now, but they're both decent. Um, it was like the, he's like a physical unit. They're, they're both pretty decent as well. Um, and then who, who else, who else? Uh, Supreme Kai of Time, pretty good, pretty uh, decent um, support as well. Uh, the Tech Cooler also has good support. I, I think he also has... Big bad bosses and stuff, so that's pretty cool. Who else? Who else? Um, yeah, I mean, there's still a lot of units I don't own, right? Uh, like, um, I don't have the base form Goku and Vegeta Sano. Who they support Goku and Vegeta family, so that's that's pretty good. Uh, the Super Saiyan Four Bardock and here, who should I put there on the first slot? Probably Bardock. That's probably who I should go with. Yeah. <clears throat> Hopefully he doesn't kill us. I, I doubt it. Does he get any more defense? He gets more defense to here. Yeah, yeah, we'll do this. Um and Bardock should be able to finish him off. Let's see how much damage we he can be doing here. Yeah, I mean two hundred and twenty seven, that's it's fine. Um, yeah, so I don't have them. I don't have a lot of the OG units either. Um, I have the Super Saiyan 4 Bardock and Gohan. Who a lot of people have been asking like, oh, will, be, will they be getting an Awakening this year? Uh, I don't think so because uh, the those type of units usually get... Um, actually, we don't have any hybrid. Okay, we'll do you, you, and we'll do Gogeta. Sure, we'll bring him, sure. And then we'll do God Temple. Um, but yeah, that, um, he, or what was I saying? Crap, I forgot what I was saying. No. Hold on, let me, let me just quickly think for a second. Oh no, it's talking about heroes. Oh, the 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 Super Saiyan Four is uh, awakenings. 
So a lot of people have been speculating like, oh, will we be getting um, the Super Saiyan 4 Awakenings this year? I don't think so because what Heroes usually does is like they they do like a, a two year time, like time span between a unit releases and a unit awakens unless a unit like comes out and they already have an awakening like for example their physical Vegito or their tech uh broly right so but yeah i mean apart from that um those those person force even as ssrs they're pretty good so i mean ho maybe we'll see them awaken but again it's only been a year so i i doubt they're going to be getting awakenings uh, maybe next year though. Um, I don't have like I I don't think I have the great salmon that great salmon unit. I don't have him. Uh, and he already has an awakening, I believe. So yeah, I mean it, it's like that, right? Like we can either be getting like Super Saiyan Four Limits Broken Vegito, or we could get like Great Salmon Three, right? Like it's it's so weird. How, how, how like different the units can be, right? Like, because Super Saiyan 4 Vegito is obviously super high, but then, like, someone like Great Saiyan Man, like, not really, no. At least not, not, not in, my, in my opinion. I'm sure it's someone out there is super hyped to get a new Great Saiyan Man, but yeah. So, yeah, who, who knows what, we, what we'll be getting for the Thank You Celebration? Maybe a global first? Maybe a global and. JP like together celebration, same time celebration. Who knows? And then I mean for December, I know we'll probably be getting. Yeah, we'll do pure Saiyan. Um. Hmm. Wait, who do I, who should I run as the second lead? Probably you. Yeah. Do you? You you for the rainbows. You and you. You for support. Yeah, that's a good team right there. Uh, but for December, that's when we'll probably be getting the Tech Gogeta. Um, so he'll probably be getting. He'll probably be the, the um, what's the word? He will probably be. He'll probably end up being the new. Uh, Christmas banner. Dude, I can't believe this guy doesn't have Super Saiyan. That was so stupid. Anyway, uh, yeah, that Go Tech Gogeta is probably going to end up being the new Christmas um, banner, right? It'll probably be the Christmas banner, and then as far as New Year's, what will we be getting from... Well, don't we usually... No, no, for... Okay, on Global for Christmas, we usually get the Global first, right? Who... Or, or actually, hmm, wait a second. So actually, we might be getting the Tech Gogeta should come out like early December, right? Because I mean, that's when we usually get like um, Super Saiyan Blue, Kaioken, Goku, and Vegeta, and who was it before them? The Go, uh, Go Bros. I mean, that was different because it was on JP, right? Or it was Global first. Um... But then apart from that, who, who was the Christmas, was there a global first for Christmas last year? Oh, let's use this. Global first for Christmas. Because I know the, the year before, wait, did... Did, was it Blue Kai and Goku? No way. No, no, no. There's no way. Because Blue Kai and Goku came out in 2019, didn't he? Yeah, I'm. I'm pretty positive he did. Here, I'm. I'm gonna look at look that up super quickly. While we fight Hirudagon here, we'll do you, 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 you. We'll do transforming Goku. You for the support, you for the support. Yeah, because I we got tech hit for Christmas. 
Then we also, yeah, then, then we got, I, I'm really curious about this now, hold on, we'll do this, we'll do this, and then, go on, you can get these, meanwhile, I'm gonna be looking that up, because I need to know, Dokkan Christmas Celebration, uh, Is this the 2020? Yeah, this, okay, so. No, this is 2018. Dang it, okay. So let's see, 2018 Christmas was. Was it Tech Hit? Yes, it was Tech Hit. So 2019, it was. It was Blue Kai and Goku. So who was it in 2020? Dude, I'm so lost. Hold on. 2020 Christmas Dokkan. Wait, was it actually? No way. It was the LR Super Saiyan Blue, Kaioken, Goku, and Vegeta? No way. But then, no, no, I don't think so. Hold on. Here, let's do Super Tech. So this was... Oh, I'm looking at the JP version. No, hold on. Here, wait, just wait a sec. Let's do you. We'll do you, you, Goku family, siblings bond, and we'll do you. Yeah. Oh, this is the last stage. Okay. Alright. Um. I'm looking it up right now, still. I will do... I will do this. Does this Goku raise defense? He does raise defense. What does this guy do? I forget. I, I forget. First attacker... Hmm. Oh, okay, okay. We can do this, and then th that Goku over there can still get a super with this. Yeah, he should still be able to... I don't want to waste all these orbs. Oh, he's sealed anyway. So it doesn't matter. Okay. Let me see... I need to do I need to know. Maybe Christmas. How can I look, look this up? Dokkan uh, Christmas Week. Dude, was it was it really the Super Saiyan Blue Goku and Vegeta? I guess so, because I don't see, I don't see like the global exclusives at all. Uh, we'll do this, no we'll do this, and then Vegeta can get these here. So yeah, I guess, I guess that was the 2020 Yeah, I, I guess so. Wow, okay. So yeah, it seems like the 2020 Christmas banner was just the the physical LR physical Super Saiyan Blue Kai and Goku and Vegeta. Okay. I was just really confused about that. Okay. It ma makes sense, I guess. I, and also if I'm if I'm wrong, on this, and I'm just like having 
like a stupid moment, like just tell me, please. Um, because I am, I, I am really intrigued. I, I, I wasn't really aware that that was the case. Hmm. So yeah, who knows what we'll be getting this year? Maybe we don't get a global exclusive, and then we just end up getting the tech. LR Gogeta for Christmas. And the New Year's should be the step up banner. Um, so yeah, we'll we'll see, we'll see. Once uh, once that all that hits, I'll probably be I'll, I'll obviously I'll be making videos on that. Um, but I'll probably come back to this topic to see how everything lines up and then we can discuss it again. Uh, okay, so Battlefield pretty pretty easy. Um, Freeza is usually kind of tough, but this one was just kind of. Pretty, pretty chill. I still have to beat it uh, another two times to complete all the missions and stuff. Uh, Alright, with that said, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the conversations we had. And again, let me know your thoughts on anything that we talked about down below. Uh, or just any comments or questions, like anything like that. Just let me know. And yeah, have a great day. And I'll see you guys in the next, next video.